Creating the staircase is pretty easy. Let's first just take a look at our model and view up from the top of that staircase there. I measured the staircase, so it is, if I take the tape measure, draw from this line here, it is nine and three quarters of an inch, and then it drops eight inches down. So with the guide there, just take the rectangle tool, draw a rectangle over that shape, and very important part here, before you extrude this, this goes with groups or components, but specifically in our case here with components. After I draw that first piece of geometry, if I know I'm isolating in this, go ahead and just make it a component right away. It makes it a lot easier to select later on. So we can right click, select make component. We can name the component. In this case, let's call this stair. You can also give it a description. I typically don't give my models descriptions here, but you can if you like. There are alignment settings, specifically for glue to settings. This is helpful for when you have sloped roofs or elements that you just want to glue to specific axes, like windows or skylights. You can also set the component axes. By default, it's going to set it in the bottom corner. For 2D face me components, so these are like people that you can have in your model or trees, you can always have them face the camera. The key here is just make sure replace selection with component is checked, and then click create. Like a group, it selects a little blue window around the model. You can go ahead and just double click on that to enter the component. Take the push pull tool and push this down eight inches and then take the select tool and click out of the component. Again, I can select it or deselect it. Orbit down and into the first floor just to take a look. The next thing that we have to do is use move copy to duplicate and repeat our stairs on the bottom here. Take the move tool, make sure option or control is selected, and copy it from the top corner right here down to the corner here. Without using another tool, just going to orbit so I can see the first floor. And because that was my last command, I can type in a duplicate. So if I want, let's say, 12, the letter X, and then hit enter, it's going to replicate our copy 12 times down the wall there. So I realize 12 isn't enough. Let's try 14X, press enter, maybe one more, 15X, enter. If you click on another tool, remember that move copy isn't going to work again. So if you mistakenly miss one, you'll have to select whatever your last copy was and just copy it from there. Now that we have the basis of the staircase, let's add some more detail like the riser and tread. 